that if the norm stayed the same, I wouldn't be going home this week. Well, after that big blow up, they that, might be having more conversations like this. That might actually be. How would it make sense for them to get rid of me and then keep Latoya? Yeah. You know what I mean? It wouldn't. It would make z zero sense. There is one hour until the power of veto ceremony. Making sure we all got it. And then a chain. Holy shit. Yeah, I gotta get somewhat on here too. I'm sorry. This conversation is between us, right? Like, I'm obviously I don't want both of you. I don't want her to say either of your That's names. That's a no-brainer. But I don't even know how they're gonna convince her to pick somebody else. They're basically gonna tell her it's gonna be a bloodbath and they're going for her. Like Gunnin, like Jed is pissed that she's trying to stronghold his win and threaten to put up his that. closest ally. He's pissed. Of course he is. He's a beast too. And if Ty stays, he's a beast. These big comps are coming, guys. Yeah. These big powerful comps for big guys like that to win, they're coming. Mm -hmm. They shook up the game by postponing them. But it'll only be so long before there's a competition just built for Ty and Jed. Oh, yeah. Only a matter of time. It could be the next one. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, we have to know that these comp beast challenges are coming. Yeah. And there's no way Jed's letting go. He's a machine. And he's driven now. And if you're on the wrong side, or if they have an inkling you're on the wrong side, guys. I know, but how do I know I can trust them? You can't trust anybody. I know. This is my problem. He makes valid points. I can't even believe it. Like, when I talk to him, I'm like, yeah. You guys are in a really good spot with both sides of the house. That can also be a very dangerous spot, though, because then people are saying, get the fucking flip-floppers out of here. Well, because they, yeah. What we're hearing is that they have you guys already set in stone. No, well, they know they have me with Pitt, because I did. I, I promised her and that if she doesn't say my name, because my name got thrown around like crazy. He said, if you don't say a, my name, it's gonna be I will vote out your target. But yeah. I said target. If her target changes, so does my vote. If her target changes and she puts row up and she says, votes row. She's not gonna say vote row. We're putting row up as bait. You would have to vote row out. Yeah, but what I'm saying is, is like. Are you comfortable doing that? What, if they pull this off? What do you think? I'm, I don't know where your allegiance lie, Ted. What's up? Hi. Did you hear that? Yeah. It's one hour. To we got to change. I don't want to change. I think I might just put socks on. I'm just going to change my <laughs> leggings and my toque. I don't know. I'm going to put my jeans on. I might touch up my makeup. Yeah, I might do the same. I look a little rough today. Actually, maybe I will leave a hat on today. Yeah. Oh, I'm leaving a hat on for show. I don't know. I don't know where Brandon went. But what I'm saying is if we don't get Tara on board, it doesn't matter what I do. It's going to be a 5-4. I know. I don't. That's what I'm saying. I, don't I want to stay loyal to our group. I don't know why Tara's flip. Like, her best spot is with us and Matoya. You know what I mean? Like, is it not? Or who? Who, who's she tight with? Like, who's involving her See, in these the, conversations? The problem, well, the problem is, is that I think she feels tighter, tight with Vic. So Vic, you know what I mean? That's crazy, because Vic threw her name out so much. Damn. Like, that's, that's the swing right there. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter where my vote goes. Yeah. Yep. Because it's just going to be a 5-4 if, if she stays over on, over there. No, I know. Right? Yeah. So, 